Hey everyone, it is Tea Time with the Diva. Grab your tea, grab your coffee, because we're going to get into it. This Tea Time is dedicated to Steph Curry and his family, Aisha Curry, his mother, Sonia Curry, um, Baby Curry, because the baby's a newborn. I think the baby only six months. And, and, and little Kenny, I think his name is, okay? I think he's six years old. Well, the family went over to um support him for the 2024 Olympics. Yes, they had a USA basketball team and they did win gold. So Steph Curry wife was there, the baby, the mother, all of you would have, they were there. The, the, the peoples was in the building to show up and show out for, you know, their family member, for Steph Curry. Well, listen, here's the thing, guys. There's one thing we need to understand. I could be big time in the U.S. and everybody know my face and my name. And everywhere I go, they like, hey, D, well, what's up? You want your regular seat? You want to sit over here? You want to do this? You want to do that? And I'm more happy and I'm good. I can't expect when I go somewhere else, like Paris, maybe France, Dubai, wherever, that these people know me all the same. And they understand my celebrity status, if I'm a said celebrity. And what we got to understand is when you go other places, you know, there was this saying, I don't know where it came from. I don't even know if you heard of it. When, uh, uh, when you were you, you, not the one there, what is the one when you in Vegas, you do like Vegas, but there's another saying like, um, if you, you know, you do like the Mohicans do or something like that. Anyway, the, the thing is that if I go to Puerto Rico, maybe I should learn some Spanish. Maybe I should learn some Spanish, especially if I want to go down in with the natives. And, and I can't be expecting to be like, excuse me, excuse me, anybody speak English? Maybe I need to get a translate on my phone and learn a little bit of Spanish if I want to get around and hang out with them. So you go to Paris, they speak in French, they're police, so you know, saying stuff to you. You like what you're saying. Nobody know, nobody can't communicate with nobody because nobody speak each other language. So what am I talking about? Well, Dee was talking about, remember, Serena had a problem because she said the restaurant wouldn't let her in. And they first they said they didn't have no tables, but later on they said we didn't recognize her. We didn't know who she was. So that tells me if y'all knew who she was, she would have y'all would have had the table for it, right? Then you got, I think Travis Scott got arrested out there in Paris. And now you got Aisha Curry. Um, somebody hit the baby. Excuse me about that. Sorry about that, y'all. Somebody hit the baby in the head. Because they was trying to explain to her, you can't go over there. But the whole reason why she couldn't go over to where she wanted to go to, to her car, is because the same time she was leaving the Paris Olympics, so was their president. And just like here, you know, when the president comes into your town or your area, nobody can move. Nobody can do nothing. And they tell you ahead of time, you better plan an alternate route. Because you can't drive your car this way. The trains won't be stopping this way. The bus won't be going this way. And you can't even go that way on foot. So let's go ahead and get into this story. I feel bad for her, but I also want to know where, 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 where was their security? So Aisha Curry fights back tears during a confrontation with the Paris police after her husband, Steph, helps the USA basketball team win Olympic gold medal. So we're going to, um, let me just see if I could uh, rewind this here. Let's see. I'll wait for it to um, rewind. So Steph Curry's wife, Aisha Curry, and his mom, Sonia Curry, were involved in a tense encounter with the French police. Okay, here, wait. Let's see. I'm sorry, guys. Let's, we might be able to play this. Curry and his mom, Sonia Curry, were involved in a tense encounter with French police after the U.S. men's basketball team won gold at the 2024 Paris Olympics. In a video posted by The Hollywood Fix, Aisha is seen wiping tears from her face as her mother-in-law speaks to officers on the street who are allegedly preventing the family from returning to their vehicle. While it's unclear what exactly went down during the confrontation, Sonia can be heard yelling that someone touched the baby in the middle of the chaos. Aisha was seen holding her and Stefan's youngest child, Caius, while she held their son, Cannon's hand. A man who came over to translate for the police can then be heard apologizing on behalf of an officer saying, sorry about the baby. The Curry family was still blocked from crossing the street to their car because French President Emmanuel Macron was apparently leaving at that time. The incident didn't seem to stop Aisha from celebrating her husband's big win, though. She later shared a photo of Steph smiling with his gold medal. Mm. 
So it was not officially time for me well, to start picking. Well, the president was leaving at the same time, and that's what the commotion and the chaos was about. So Seth Curry's wife, Aisha Curry, and his mom, Sonia Curry, were involved in a tense encounter with French police after the U.S. men's basketball team won gold at the 2024 Paris Olympics. A video posted by the Hollywood Fix Sunday showed Aisha wiping tears from her face as her mother-in-law spoke to officers on the street who were allegedly preventing the family from returning to their vehicle. While it's unclear what exactly went down during the confrontation, Sonia can be heard yelling that someone touched the baby amid the chaos. So apparently, I don't know if the baby rubbed against the baby, but one of the cops or the officers, you know, I guess accidentally touched the baby. And that had Aisha probably crying and the mother-in-law like, yo, what's going down? The Sweet July founder, 35, was seen holding her and Steph's youngest child, three-month-old, and on her, on her chest in a baby carrier while she held their six-year-old son's hand by the hand. And that's the picture. They're a beautiful family. So look, they won't let us go back over there where we came from, Sonia said in the video. They won't let the driver come over here and they won't let us go back over there. A man who came over to translate for the police can be um, heard apologizing on the behalf of an officer saying, sorry about the baby. However, the Carey family was still blocked from crossing the street to their car because French President Emmanuel Macron was apparently leaving at the same time. They had to protect our president just like here in the U.S. we protect ours, right? So Stephen Curry, um, 36, was not seen in the video, but his teammate, um, um, Dredman Green eventually intervened as well. So even after him hitting the baby in the head, there's still nothing y'all could do to get them out of here. Green 34 asked the officers before the recording cuts off. The family has yet to address the matter publicly. Page six reached out to the rest for Seth, Aisha, um, and Green for a comment, but did not immediately hear back. The Curry Ferry incident with um, French police comes after Team USA defeated France 98 to 87 to clinch the gold medal on Saturday at the arena. Stephen um, Curry, who became the first time Olympic champion, scored 24 points to lead the American squad to victory in his fifth consecutive gold medal. Also, they always um, taking the, the Olympics by storm, okay? LeBron James, Kevin Durant, and Devin Booker were also high scorers during the game. So, you know, congratulations to the team. I think that also in addition to everything, to me, in my opinion, um, she should have been, um, she should have had, what do you call it? She should have had security, right? She should have had security with her and security should be blocking um, her against like anybody like that's going to be in the midst of her. Sorry about that, guys. I'm going to go ahead and stop sharing the screen. So listen, y'all know the routine. Chat with me in the comments. And when I get an opportunity, I will chat back. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that every time I upload a video, you will be notified. If you are a subscriber, welcome back. Everybody, thanks for watching. Don't forget, hit the like button. Let me know your thoughts on this video. And I'll see you on the next video.